Hi everyone. So we have come to the end of a quarter of the year. So it's time to look back at my quarterly writing goals from last quarter and see if I accomplished any of them and make a plan for the next three months. So my quarterly writing goals, April through June feeling pretty good about this because I got a lot of writing and stuff done in the last few months, so this should be good. Brainstorm and outline the third Finding Hope book. I did do that. Number two, finish the tragedy of the traitor. I did do that. Post weekly vlogs. I want to say I did that because in the last two months I have been posting weekly vlogs. But in April, I missed a couple. I might have missed them in May. I don't know. The beginning of this quarter was a little rough. But by the end, I was very regular. Maybe I get like a half check mark on that one. Four, stay on top of author social media. I'm getting better. Again, at the beginning of the quarter, it was more sporadic. But towards the end, I was more on top of it. That's again another half check mark. Edit the tragedy of the traitor. This is, I have a little mark, if finished. It was finished. And it is with my editors and beta readers at the moment. So that counts, right? I'm just not finished with editing, although I didn't expect it to be. I didn't even expect to be finished with the book. I'm calling it a win. It's with my editors, it's just not finished yet. But that's not my fault, that's entirely on them. <laughs> not that they're behind, they're perfectly on schedule. Anyway. And the last one, Published Courageous Heart, which I did do. So basically I did everything. I mean at the beginning I was not as great with doing vlogs every week and all my author social media stuff. What are you doing, Ada? <laughs> but by the end I was great. I don't know. Next month. So I had next quarter's, most of next quarter's high writing goals <laughs> uh, already written out and on a schedule and everything. Which was a good thing because this last quarter I got ahead on writing, so I moved into this quarter's things. So I might have to adjust a little bit. Write The Queen of Caradale, which is the third Finding Hope book which I've already written because I ran out of things to write last quarter. <laughs> so that's already checkmarked. I don't know if I should count that for last quarter this quarter. What are you doing, Ada? And then I have edit the tragedy of the traitor. I think my editors, that should be accomplished in this summer. And publishing the tragedy of the traitor. Also, staying on top of blogs and author social media. Because what I was gonna write this quarter is already written. Don't eat the bed, what are you doing? Anyway, what I was going to write is already written. So I'm going to put writing my next book, which is... It doesn't really have a title yet. I'm calling it Kaylin right now because that's the title of the main character, but that's not necessarily going to be the name of the book. It's a working title, which is definitely not going to be the final title. At least I don't think so. Anyway, so that's what I'm going to be writing in the next quarter. I also want to go through and do some editing with my previous books, especially like my first Robin Hood, Lucy's Legend, which was the first book that I ever self-published. So there's a lot of cringy mistakes, like no title page or copyright page and, you know, things of that nature. Um, so I want to go through and fix that up, and I'm going to do that with all of the books that need it putting that in this quarter. I don't know if I'll get to them all, but I'm definitely going to put them down. I have nine things on this list. It's much more than last month. But I did so fantastic last quarter that I think I could totally do this. I did very well with my writing goals last quarter. Hopefully it'll be as great this quarter. We link in the description where you can find my website where all of my Robin Hood books and my dystopian trilogy, Finding Hope. Ada is being very strange today. <laughs> Anyway, happy writing, everybody.